Welcome back, everyone. This is episode 2.3, talking about muscle action. So the important thing to remember with muscles is that it's much more important to know the actions of muscles rather than their exact origin insertion. So you're, you're doing pretty well if you know the actions of every muscle and where it is in general when you're being asked questions such as, you know, how many joints does a muscle cross? So let's start at the head. We have the temporalis muscle, which does TMJ elevation, protrusion, and medial and lateral excursion. So the temporalis does TMJ elevation, protrusion, and medial and lateral excursion. The masseter muscle does TMJ elevation, protrusion, retrusion, and medial and lateral excursion. The masseter muscle, TMJ elevation, protrusion, retrusion, medial and lateral excursion. The lateral pterygoid, TMJ depression, protrusion, medial and lateral excursion. Lateral pterygoid, TMJ depression, protrusion, medial and lateral excursion. Medial pterygoid, TMJ elevation, protrusion, medial and lateral excursion. Medial pterygoid, TMJ elevation, protrusion, medial and lateral excursion. Suprahyoid, TMJ depression. Suprahyoid, TMJ depression. Infrahyoid, also TMJ depression. Infrahyoid, TMJ depression. And finally for the head, the digastric muscle, TMJ retrusion. Digastric muscle, TMJ retrusion. Moving down to the cervical spine, we have the sternocleidomastoid, or SCM, flexion, rotation, and side bending. SCM, flexion, rotation, and side bending. Should be noted here that SCM performs contralateral rotation, which is very unique due to its oblique orientation. Moving on, the longest coli, the cervical flexion, longest coli cervical flexion. The scalenes together perform flexion, rotation, and side bending. The anterior and middle scalenes perform first rib elevation, and the posterior scalenes perform second rib elevation. Scalenes, flexion, rotation, and side bending of the cervical spine. Anterior and middle scalenes, first rib elevation. Posterior scalenes, second rib elevation. Splenus cervicus, extension, rotation, and side bending. Splenius cervicus, extension, rotation, and side bending. Semispinalis cervicus, extension. Semispinalis cervicus, extension. Iliocostalis cervicus, extension, rotation, and side bending. Iliocostalis cervicus, extension, rotation, side bending. Longissimus cervicus, extension, rotation, side bending. Longissimus cervicus, extension, rotation, side bending. Multifidus, extension, rotation, and side bending. Multifidus, extension, rotation, and side bending. Trapezius muscles, extension. Trapezius fibers, extension. Levator scapulae, rotation and side bending. Levator scapulae, rotation and side bending. Moving down to the thoracolumbar spine, rectus abdominis performs flexion. Rectus abdominis, flexion. The eternal obliques perform flexion, rotation, and lateral bending. External oblique, flexion, rotation, and lateral bending. External oblique, flexion, rotation, and lateral bending. The erector spinae muscles primarily perform extension of the back. Erector spinae, extension. Quadratus lumborum, extension, rotation, and lateral bending. Quadratus lumborum, extension, rotation, and lateral bending. Multifidus muscles again, extension, rotation, and lateral bending. Multifidus, extension, rotation, and lateral bending. So as major, rotation, and lateral bending. So as major, rotation, and lateral bending. Longissimus thoracis, rotation, and lateral bending. Longissimus thoracis rotation and lateral bending. 
iliocostalis, thoracis, rotation and lateral bending, iliocostalis, thoracis, rotation and lateral bending. Rotaries, contralateral rotation and lateral bending. Rotaries, contralateral rotation and lateral bending. Scapular muscles, upper trapezius performs elevation of the scapula, upper trapezius, elevation, lower trapezius performs depression, lower trapezius, depression, middle trapezius, upward rotation and retraction, middle trapezius, upward rotation and retraction, levator scapulae, elevation and downward rotation, levator scapulae, elevation and downward rotation, serratus anterior, Protraction and upward rotation, serratus anterior, protraction, upward rotation. Pectoralis minor, protraction, depression, downward rotation. Pectoralis minor, protraction, depression, downward rotation. Pectoralis major, depression. Pectoralis major, depression. Latissimus dorsi, depression. Latissimus dorsi, depression. And finally, the rhomboids perform retraction and downward rotation. Rhomboids, retraction and downward rotation. Moving on to the shoulder joint, anterior deltoids perform flexion and internal rotation. Anterior deltoids, flexion and internal rotation. Posterior deltoids perform extension and external rotation. Posterior deltoid, extension, external rotation. Lateral deltoid performs abduction. Lateral deltoid, abduction. Pectoralis major, flexion, adduction, internal rotation. Pectoralis major, flexion, adduction, internal rotation. The biceps performs flexion, biceps, flexion. Supraspinatus performs abduction, supraspinatus, abduction. Teres minor performs external rotation, teres minor, external rotation. Teres major performs extension and internal rotation. Teres major, extension and internal rotation. Infraspinatus performs external rotation. Infraspinatus, external rotation. Latissimus dorsi, extension, internal rotation, adduction of the shoulder. Latissimus dorsi, extension, internal rotation, adduction. Finally, subscapularis, internal rotation, subscapularis, internal rotation. Moving on to the elbow joint, biceps performs elbow flexion, biceps flexion. Brachialis, also flexion, brachialis flexion. Brachioradialis, flexion, brachioradialis flexion. The triceps perform extension, triceps extension. And the anconius muscle performs extension, anconius extension. Moving down to the radio ulnar joint, the biceps perform supination, biceps supination. The supinator muscle performs supination, supinator supination. Pronator teres muscle performs pronation, pronator teres pronation. And finally, the pronator quadratus, pronation. Pronator, quadratus, pronation. The last joint of the upper extremity, the wrist joint, flexor carpi radialis, FCR, flexion and radial deviation, flexor carpi radialis, flexion and radial deviation. Flexor carpi ulnaris, or FCU, performs flexion and ulnar deviation, flexor carpi ulnaris, flexion and ulnar deviation. The palmaris longus muscle performs flexion. Remember that it's absent in about 14% of the population. Palmaris longus, wrist flexion. Extensor carpi radialis longus, extension and radial deviation. Extensor carpi, carpi radialis longus, extension and radial deviation. Extensor carpi radialis brevis, extension and radial deviation. Extensor carpi radialis brevis, extension and radial deviation. Extensor carpi ulnaris, extension and ulnar deviation. Extensor carpi ulnaris, extension and ulnar deviation. Extensor pollicis longus, radial deviation. Extensor pollicis longus, radial deviation.
extensor pollicis brevis, radial deviation, extensor pollicis brevis, radial deviation. Moving down to the lower extremity, beginning at the hip, the iliopsoas complex performs flexion, iliopsoas flexion. The sartorius muscle performs flexion and external rotation, sartorius flexion and external rotation. Rectus femoris performs flexion, rectus femoris hip flexion. Pectineus flexion and internal rotation, pectineus flexion and internal rotation. Gluteus maximus hip extension and external rotation, gluteus maximus hip extension and external rotation. Gluteus medius, extension, abduction, and internal rotation. Gluteus medius, extension, abduction, and internal rotation. Gluteus minimus, abduction, and internal rotation. Gluteus minimus, abduction, and internal rotation. Semitendinosus, extension. Semitendinosus, extension. Semimembranosus, extension. Semimembranosus, extension. Biceps femoris, extension, biceps femoris, extension. Piriformis, abduction and external rotation of the hip. Piriformis, abduction and external rotation. Obturator internus, abduction and external rotation. Obturator internus, abduction and external rotation. Tensor fascia lata, abduction and internal rotation. The TFL, abduction and internal rotation. Adductor magnus and brevis perform adduction. Adductor magnus and brevis perform adduction. Adductor longus performs adduction as well as internal rotation. Adductor longus, adduction and internal rotation. Gracilis, adduction. Gracilis, adduction. Obturator externus, external rotation. Obturator externus, external rotation. And finally, the gemelli muscles perform external rotation. The gemelli muscles perform external rotation. Moving down to the knee, biceps femoris, semitendinosus, and semimembranosus perform knee flexion. Biceps femoris, semitendinosus, and semimembranosus perform knee flexion. Sartorius, knee flexion. Sartorius, knee flexion. Rectus femoris, extension. Rectus femoris, extension. And finally, the vastus muscles, lateralis, intermedius, and medialis perform extension. The vastus muscles perform knee extension. Moving down to the ankle, tibialis posterior, plantar flexion and inversion. Tibialis posterior, plantar flexion and inversion. The gastrocnemius, plantar flexion, gastrocnemius, plantar flexion. The soleus, plantar flexion, soleus, plantar flexion. Peroneus longus and brevis muscles perform plantar flexion and eversion. Peroneus longus and brevis, plantar flexion and eversion. Peroneus tertius performs dorsiflexion and eversion. Peroneus tertius, dorsiflexion and eversion. The plantaris muscle, Plantar flexion, plantaris, plantar flexion. Flexor halicus, plantar flexion, flexor halicus, plantar flexion. Tibialis anterior, dorsiflexion, and inversion. Tibialis anterior, dorsiflexion, and inversion. Extensor halicus longus, dorsiflexion. Extensor halicus longus, dorsiflexion. Extensor digitorum longus, dorsiflexion. Extensor digitorum longus, dorsiflexion. Flexor digitorus longus, inversion. Flexor digitorum longus, inversion. That concludes the muscle action section. The next episode, 2.4, will talk more about the upper extremity joints. Thank you.